one of the most used elements when it comes to video editing is transitions. So today I want to take a step away from a tutorial and take a review at a brand new pack that has 1700 transitions for After Effects. Hey, what's going on internet? This is Josh Noel from Sunduck Film, and if you're new here, be sure to hit that subscribe button. So today we're gonna take a really close look at an awesome transitions pack full of 1700 transitions for After Effects. And the reason why I'm reviewing this transitions pack specifically because there's a handful out there is that this transitions pack is not just seamless transitions. There's a lot of artistic and creative type transitions that are great for After Effects. So in this video, we're gonna take a look at this awesome transitions pack and see how it can be used on a wide variety of projects, whether it's After Effects motion graphic work or video transitions. So let's go ahead and jump into our review and let's take a look. All right, we have After Effects loaded up and here's Animation Studio with the 1700 transitions. And what's cool about this is you can click on one category and you can preview the transition before you apply it. And there's a handful of different variations of each style. What's cool about it is all the transitions that are more the artistic side are right at the top call in the design category. So, so you have you know even glitches um, and a whole bunch of other things that you can quickly add. And of course you have all your typical you know transitions that you would expect out of a you know transitions pack that you would apply to pretty much anything. So if you easily want to apply a transition, we can click on a transition that we want to add and click on apply. And it'll automatically load it into our composition and it'll put it in place right at the marker. So if you don't have your playhead where it needs to be, you just move the marker to the cut of the two clips and boom, there is our glitch transition. And if this isn't the transition for us, we'll just delete it. And we can take a look at some other categories in here. So if we want maybe perhaps going into the light leaks folder and taking a look at some of the presets in here, we can take a look if we'd like it, you know, click apply. Boom, there's a nice little light leak transition. And instead of using a light leak, I quickly applied a panoramic transition. And there's a whole bunch of those transitions in here, a ton of seamless transitions that can be easily applied as well. So you pretty much have every single category that you would want in a transitions pack. And there's so many creative based transitions in this pack compared to most other transitions packs that, so this is great for like After Effects motion graphic projects where things are a little bit more abstract. So in this pack, you easily have the practical use for your video transitions. If you wanna create a very smooth and professional video and you have your creative based transitions for motion graphics. Um, and other sort of artistic type content. So if you wanna learn about this brand new pack called Transitions Library, you can check our links in the video description. So I hope you guys enjoyed this review video and found it insightful. If you're new here, be sure to hit the subscribe button because we post multiple post-production tutorials every single week. You can also hit me up on my social media networks. Those links are in the description. And always be creating.